Welcome back everybody, my name is Jim. Thank you for joining me again on the RV Concierge channel. Today we're gonna do a review of a 2021 Coachman Pursuit 29 SS. This is a pre-owned. But before we get started, let's say hello to Abby. And Rosie, hi everyone, thanks and, for watching. And our little doggy. <laughs> <laughs> Abby, as always, thank you for helping out with the camera. My pleasure. So the Coachman Pursuit is built on the F53 chassis. This one does have the Triton V10. The new ones are gonna have the 7.3 liter V8. This one does have side view and backup cameras. But before we get started, let's do tire size, cargo carrying capacity. We'll do a loop of the outside, we'll jump on the inside. All right. All right, so these are the Goodyear tires and they are 245.70 R19.5. Cargo carrying capacity of this coach. I do not see the sticker. I'm not going to search forever. But this has got a ton of cargo parents. <laughs> it's a class A and they're much better than the C's. All right, so we do have a solar hookup right there. So if you want to put solar panels on a stand or something, you can do that. Uh, it does have a power awning with the LED light. Very nice. And they got some magnets on these doors, which is nice because that's going to hold those up. Oh, cool. You got storage right here. A little bit. Nice, a little bit. <laughs> Yeah. An outside outlet on the 110 or 110 outlet on a GFI circuit. Right here, you have more storage. Cool. Your waste tanks are in that one, so that does not go up and through. This one does have an outside entertainment Very TV. nice. Very nice underneath the awning out here. Over here, we got a big compartment. Look at what's in here. Outside kitchen, maybe? You got it. You got an outside kitchen here with the refrigerator, a little bit of storage, nice little sink. I like this. And a drawer. This is a perfect little outside kitchen. It is. And you do have a remote propane hookup there. So oh, if you want awesome. to That's even got a cute little backsplash in there. That's real tile. Yeah, this Last is a really tile. adorable. Way to go, Coachman. I like it. Yeah, very nice. All right, and then back here, you got a full pass through storage big area you can put a grill or whatever you want in this very nice all right coming around to the back they do give you a ladder to access the roof this does have a bumper you can store your sewer tube in 5,000 pound hitch with the seven pin connector you got your backup camera up high there is a bedroom window in this one I like that yeah your fuel fills right there Abby, I like that they put the uh, exhaust for the generator out the back so it's not coming out near your slide out. Now this does have a, have a full wall slide out with a slide topper on it. Wow. Right here is your sure power cord hookup. Nice. And the rest of your full pass through storage that goes all the way through to the other side. This one has the generator in it and it's locked. Can't get it open. You got your propane furnace right there. Microwave is vented outside. I like that. You got your wet bay right here, your dump station with your outside shower. You got your low point drains in there too for the plumbing. Right here, you got your park cable hookup, your city water connection, and your fresh tank water fill. Over here, you have your water heater. This one has to have the propane tank in it because there's no locks on this door. And then, then right there is your hydraulics for your leveling jacks. And last compartment, this one is storage. A little Very bit. Nice. A little bit of storage. <laughs> you got it. You got your other side view camera right there. You got your air conditioners dripping onto the ground because it's nice and hot today. <laughs> Abby, that's the outside of this beautiful coach. Let's go take a look at the inside. Let's go. Slide out is in. Let's show them how you can get to the refrigerator, bathroom, and bedroom with the slide out closed. I don't think we have any problems, maybe with it with Rosie on the front of you. I know, Rose. I think we're making it through. 
access to the bathroom. Rosie's checking it out. She likes it so far, Jimmy. <laughs> access to the bedroom and refrigerator. All right, let's open it up and show them the rest. All right, let's do it. Let's start at the cab and we'll work our way back. So these front seats do swivel around and become part of the living space. This coach does have full automatic hydraulic leveling system, power heated mirrors. You got your radio, which is separate from your turn signal and backup camera. I mean, everything in this cab faces the driver, which is very nice. It's very nice. And I then like you do it. have a nice little workstation here with some power ports up there. There's even a 110 outlet right underneath the dash somewhere. So I see it right there. And you got a little cup holder there. No carpet whatsoever. They put the dog house or the co engine cover and uh, vinyl or I'm not even sure that is fiberglass. It's pretty hard. But you got sheet vinyl throughout, which is very nice. Over on the driver's side, you have a jackknife sofa. You got some nice storage. I love this. That's pretty. This woodwork is really nice, too. Very pretty. I like it. On the patio side, patio side dinette. You know I like that. I do, too. With a ton of storage above there. Really makes a difference. It does. I like looking out onto my own patio rather than the neighbors. Mm -hmm. and it's just kind of creepy when you're watching them eat out of their picnic table. <laughs> Um, so when these front seats swivel around, Abby, they're looking directly at this TV. Oh, okay. But the TV is on a swing arm, so you can angle it over towards the sofa or whoever's sitting in the rear. It's place. really in a great position. It is. It's a good location to be able to view from everywhere, except for right here. <laughs> right. Got a really nice sized kitchen. What what twenty nine footer is going to have this kind of space between the cooktop and the sink? Wow. That yeah. There's a lot of prep space right there. It is. Cute tile backsplash that's all glass and you do have a kitchen window. A couple soft closed drawers and all the books. And looks like you can fit a wastebasket right there. And some upper cabinets. Good amount of storage there. I like it. Yeah, very nice. Got a microwave oven right there. And again, this hood is vented outside. It's got a light and a, a fan on it. Really nice 12 volt residential refrigerator. So it's on right now, but that's because I have the uh, the disconnect on. So you have a nice porcelain toilet here with the pedal flush. Look at all that countertop. We'll get some dead flies in here. We'll need to clean this. Mm -hmm. Nice countertop space and some storage right below. Storage below there. A little mirror and some storage up here. And a pretty good sized shower. I can fit in here no problem. Wash my hair. I, mean, I think both of us could get in here. What do you think? Maybe some good clean fun. Just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of good clean fun. All right, wow, I didn't even see this has an oven. It's got a little oven, very nice. All right, coming on back, you got a little bit of storage right here. Could be a broom closet. Looks like you can hang some clothes. I think that's what I would call it. Yeah, a little broom closet, some storage up here. Yeah. Almost all of your controls are right here in the middle, which is very nice. Pocket door at the bedroom. We like pocket doors. We do. Now this has a queen bed with huge nightstands on either side and there are 12 charging pads as well as 110 those are outlets. huge nightstands look at all that they're big space. yeah and there there's hanging closets on either side open one of those up up top it has like hanger hooks on it oh i see it and then you got a ton of storage over top of the bed and the cool part about that one of them is equipped with a um cpap outlet in there so Run a CPAP machine, you can put it right through that little black access hole. You got wardrobes on either side here. That is very nice. Come on around, you're gonna get in there. You want to get, you see this one? <laughs> the other one's exactly the same. <laughs> and then you got your liquor cabinet. Yeah, hey, there, that's <laughs> a big liquor cabinet. It is, it is. And another liquor cabinet. I'm just kidding. Wow. Well, there's a ton of storage in ton. here. Three really deep drawers. Look at those drawers. I love the color. Identical. Too. Yep. And I think there's a little bit of storage under this bed, but the rest is the outside kitchen. I like it a lot. Yeah. Yep. I'm digging it. And uh, the nice Cute. rear window, too, to let in some outside light. Mm -hmm. This is a really nice coach. Abby, let's get oh. the ones through and we'll wrap this up. Let's do it. Jimmy, is this still available? Abby, this one is still available, surprisingly enough. This is the only Class A gas that we have in stock right now. And it happens to be a 2021, but it's pre owned. So if you would like to know more, if you have any questions, you can text, call, or email me. Information is right there. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Stay tuned for more. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Please subscribe.